nice to see us, uh, you know, battle through a little bit of adversity there and still come away with a win. I thought um, they did a nice job of uh, making a push there in the second half, got the ball inside, started hitting us pretty good on the boards, and I thought we um, we responded, um, which is uh, is a good sign. It, I think the guys have stayed the course, and uh, we've had some pretty good practices uh, leading up to the last, I guess, couple weeks of the season. And, um, you know, hopefully we can uh, continue to play well and, and make a good push here coming down the stretch with a really tough St. Joe's team coming in here this week, and then we go on the road for a few. So we got a tough stretch ahead of us, but I think our guys are uh, ready to compete and play. Um, yeah, I was worried about it because they told me it was the same injury as um, Malik Hines. But, I mean, once I started, you know, walking around, you know, got through the walkthrough, and I actually did a couple of little exercises right before the game. I mean, I was feeling good. So, I mean, once I step on the court, I don't feel anything. Of course, you know that the bigs, you know, they're always going to battle down there. You know, they're going to get their rebounds. But we need, you know, the guards to be down there as with them, you know, and just to help them out, give them, you know, a little break or two. You know what I'm saying? Just in, you don't want them, you know, down there battling, you know, too hard, you know, just getting rough, toughed up. You know, it's just good, you know, just to be down there, you know, to help them out. Yeah, I thought he did a great job. He's not settling. Um, we talked about it. You know, he's, uh, he, he knows that, that one-legged kind of Kobe Bryant fade away. Uh, <laughs> hopefully we won't see that uh, the rest of the year. And uh, he gave us a good presence on uh, that mid post, kind of driving it to the rim where he uh, he gave us some some good buckets. And uh, I like that he went two for two from the free throw line. Um, so that was a good game for him. He probably could up his rebound total just a tad, uh, <laughs> just a little bit. <laughs> uh, but yeah, he's he's given us some of the stuff that I was uh, hopeful that he he could bring. I believe so. Uh, I just think I'm a better player when I'm, uh, you know, more aggressive and, like you said, not settling. So, you know, just being aggressive, you know, just, uh, you know, makes those kind of outcomes. If I can just get to the rim and, you know, make uh, my shots easier, not taking tough shots and, you know, fade away and stuff like that. So when it's a little more spread out, they, we did a better job tonight of, like, running offense and not settling for stuff early in the shot clock. Sometimes that's why our defense has been a little suspect um, is because we're taking tough shots on offense and they're getting – we're in uh, some adverse defensive position. So I think our offense was a little better, and we shared the ball, and we moved them some, and then um, that led to a good defense.